welcome children we will learn about ecosystem and its components in this module you have learnt about adaptations and habitats in your previous session going further in this module you will be able to learn about ecosystem and its components what is an ecosystem an ecosystem is a system in which many living organisms interact with each other and also with their non living environment it is made up of all living things and also the non living things on which it is dependent now let us learn about the components of the ecosystem an ecosystem is mainly divided into two parts the biotic and the abiotic talking about the biotic factors as we know that bio means life so all the living things present at a particular place they may be plants animals bacteria fungi makes up the biotic components of that ecosystem the abiotic factors abiotic means lifeless or without life here the abiotic components are the non living things present in that environment at a particular place which are essential for the development of biotic components so we can clearly say that biotic and abiotic together makes up an ecosystem now since you have developed a good understanding about what are the biotic and abiotic components of the ecosystem we will now step further towards ecosystem organization children when we talk about the ecosystem organization we are generally talking about only the biotic components you can see in the image the ecosystem is organized into organisms population community organism is an individual living thing when these individual living things come in a group they form a population and when many population come together they contribute towards a community and when these community interact with the abiotic components of that particular area it is termed as an ecosystem difference between habitat and ecosystem children usually get confused between habitat and ecosystem habitat is talking about one organism and its specific needs whereas ecosystem refers to many organisms staying together and interacting with their environment there are many habitats within an ecosystem because the ecosystem comprises of many kinds of animals staying together let us do a quick recap of whatever we learned in this video we learned about the ecosystem that it is made up of two components that is the biotic and the abiotic the biotic components consist of the producers consumers and decomposers whereas the abiotic components are the non living components of that area which are very essential for the development of the biotic components now using your thinking skills identify all the biotic and abiotic components present in the picture and write them using a t chart in your spiral thank you so much for watching the video i hope it was fruitful